Hello caregivers and thank you for joining us with our Tales and Tales Toddler Time for Summer Reading. Featured in these short story times will be infant to toddler read alouds and activities that you can easily duplicate at home to promote a love of literacy with your little one in a fun and engaging manner. Information about incorporating this at home, as well as the related titles I mentioned in each video can be found below. If you like what you see, be sure to subscribe and like, um, and then you'll be notified of any upcoming videos that we have on our channel. All right, let's go ahead and get started with our toddler tale for today. Hi boys and girls, welcome back to another story time. I am so glad you could join us on this dreary day. As you can tell at our puppet farm, it looks like there may be a storm coming. In fact, all of our animals are inside the barn. Oh goodness. Well, let's go ahead and get ready for a story before it starts raining. Do you remember our story song? Awesome job. If you're ready for a story, clap your hands. If you're ready for a story, clap your hands. If you're ready for a story, if you're ready for a story, if you're ready for a story, clap your hands. If you're ready for a story, zip your lips. Zip. If you're ready for a story, zip your lips. Zip. If you're ready for a story, if you're ready for a story, if you're ready for a story, zip your lips. Zip. If you're ready for a story, put on those listening ears. If you're ready for a story, put on your listening ears. If you're ready for a story, if you're ready for a story, if you're ready for a story, put on those listening ears. Right, last one. If you're ready for a story, sit so still. If you're ready for a story, sit so still. If you're ready for a story, if you're ready for a story, if you're ready for a story, sit so still. Awesome job, boys and girls. Uh-oh. I hear thunder. Better part. I'm probably ready. Oh, oh, I hear something else, yeah. boys and girls. It's a kitty cat. Yeah. Oh, kitty cat is stuck out in the rain. Let's get inside because Kitty Cat says all of their friends have already gone in. Let's go. Oh, boys and girls, we made it inside just in time. It started pouring down rain. But there's one thing that most kitty cats don't like. It's rain and water. So we have our kitty cat safe here. And look who we found. It's all of Kitty Cat's missing friends. Let's count how many friends our kitty cat has. We've got one, two, three. Oh, what are you doing up there? Four, five, six, seven, eight. That is eight friends that kitty cat has. And if we count this kitty cat, that's nine kitty cats for story time. That's a lot of kitty cats. They are all so excited for our story. Are you ready? All right, let's settle this kitty cat down right here and show me you're ready. How do we sit for story time? You sit quietly and you gotta put on your listening ears because today's story is all about kitty cats and we're learning about colors. How many of you know about your colors already? Oh, I bet you do, but if you don't, don't worry, because we are learning today. And at the end of the story, we're going to learn about what happens when you mix some colors and what colors they turn into, which is super exciting. All right, let's get started. All right, boys and girls, we have our story, Kitten, and here's three colors. How many of you recognize these three colors? We have... Red, good job. Yellow, amazing. And blue, fantastic work. While we read our story, there's gonna be some new colors that you learn too. Let's go ahead and get started. 
we're going to open up to our title page. Let's practice those colors again. We have kitten. Good. Amazing. And fantastic. We have red, yellow, blue, and it looks like our kittens are wearing special hats that might come into our story too. Hmm. Mrs. Tuttle's cat Sophia had 16 calico kittens. Everybody in the neighborhood wanted them. Here's all of the calico kittens, all 16. And then here is mommy kitten, Sophia, and this is Mrs. Tuttle. Now here's some neighbors that might want some of those kittens. Hmm, let's continue and find out. Oh, Sophia wonders how Mrs. Tuttle can tell the kittens apart. Mrs. Tuttle finds it quite simple because Red Kitten rescues with Dave, the firefighter. See all the red in our picture? Who are they rescuing? A dog! A poor dog got stuck in a tree. And our Red Kitten went to help. And how do you see, do you see something that says that this is Red Kitten? Let's get a closer look. Red Kitten has a red collar. All right, be on the lookout while we continue. This is our, what color kitten? Yellow. Yellow kitten digs with Tom, the construction worker. And while they're digging, they found a mole taking a bath. What's it doing down there? Ooh, what color do you think this kitten is? It's our police officer wearing. Blue, that's right. Blue Kitten patrols with Francine, the police officer. And they found a culprit who was disobeying this sign. The sign says no fishing, no dogs, no smoking, no bicycles, and no radios. There's Dog. He's got a fishing pole and a radio. He's smoking a pipe and riding a bicycle. He's breaking all the rules. So... Blue Kitten is helping out. They're gonna catch him. <gasps> Meanwhile, our Green Kitten, how many of you know that color? This beautiful color here is green. Green Kitten gardens with Paul, the landscaper. So see our Green Kitten posing right here? And Paul is trimming this bush to look just like our Green Kitten. On the other page, we see another color. How many of you know this color? It's one of my favorite colors. It's purple. Purple kitten performs with Zach, the musician. So our purple kitten here not only performs, but has this fabulous hairstyle to match. Ooh, this is my second favorite color. Oh, what is it? You see all that? Orange. How many of you know what this person is? It's a basketball player. So our orange kitten plays with Chelsea, the basketball player, and gets really into the game. Ooh. This color right here is on the truck, and our person is wearing it. What is that color? Good job, it's brown. Brown Kitten delivers with Katie the courier by distracting the dog so Katie can deliver that package. What a helpful kitten. Black Kitten exercises with Perry, the karate instructor. Look at them doing some karate. How many of you know karate out there? It's an excellent sport to know. Or maybe some of you like to cook. White Kitten right here cooks with Mario the chef. And it looks like 
White Kitten's doing a little more than cooking. It's also getting to eat. Yum, yum, the best parts of cooking. Ooh, this one might be a little tricky. See a lot of white here and some black. And, oh, what's this down here? It's a toolbox. They must be working on this car. And some feet. What color is this? Do you know this color? It's gray. Gray Kitten works with Benny, the mechanic. And here's Gray Kitten popping out to say hello while they're working underneath that car. Oh, it's another fun activity to do. This is our ballerina. It says our pink kitten practices with Zoe, the ballerina. And not only is pink kitten helping, but so is the bird. Look at them striking those poses together. Isn't that sweet? <gasps> Ooh, this is a color you might not know. This is, it looks a lot like another color we know. It's kind of like blue. This is called turquoise. Can you say turquoise? It's a fun one to say. Turquoise kitten flies with Audrey the pilot and it looks like, <gasps> Turquoise Kitten's a little scared, but even though Turquoise Kitten is scared, it's being brave and getting up there in the sky to fly high. Oh, here's another color that you might have heard of. This is called Rust. It's a little red, a little brown. It's called Rust. Rust Kitten repairs with Tony the plumber. It looks like they have got a job. Look at all that water in the basement. Oh no. There's even a whale splashing around in there. It's gotten so high. <gasps> oh, look, where are we at? We're at a hospital. And this color looks a little bit like green. It's called teal. Can you say teal? Our teal kitten is curing with Luann, the pediatrician. Pediatrician means a kid doctor, so they take care of kids just like you. So they are helping this little girl out with her broken arm. Oh, this is another kind of brown. It is a kind of a lighter brown. It's called tan. And where is this kitten working at? Hmm? The grocery store. So our tan kitten bags with Doug the clerk. Oh, it looks like tan kitten is playing a joke on this dog right here. Does it look like the dog's happy about it? No, because kitten drew on the dog food and it says hog food. That's not nice. Ooh, this is a color that is fun to say. It looks like yellow, doesn't it? It is called chartreuse. Can you say chartreuse? It's fun to say. Chartreuse kitten directs with Celia, the crossing guard. So if people get safely across the road, chartreuse kitten is helping out. Oh no, with all those kittens out in the world, poor Sophia misses her babies very much. <gasps> so, Mrs. Tuttle has a party and all the kittens come bringing all their colors with them. Isn't that so sweet? In fact, it makes Sophia Kitten very happy to see her babies. The end. Well, boys and girls, I hope you enjoyed our story, Kitten, Red, Yellow, Blue. And now I want to share with you this story, The Color Kittens. We're actually not gonna read it, but if you want to check it out, be sure to come by the library and pick it up. It is all about color mixing, and it talks about what awesome colors that you can make when you mix colors together. For example, if you have, what color is this? Red, that's right. 
if you have red and you take, what color is this one? Blue, and you mix them together, you would get the awesome color purple. Isn't that really neat? What are what other colors we can get? Let's see here. Let's take our blue and mix it with the yellow. And we're gonna mix it, mix it, mix it, mix it, and we get a green. Good job, boys and girls. All right, what if we take our, what was this? Yellow and we mix it with red. Mix, 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 mix. We get orange. Yay! So that's how you make three colors. But I actually have some other ones because I know somebody out there is asking about one specific color. So we have our red again. And we mix with our White, mix, 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 and what do you think we'll get? We get pink. That's how you get pink. You take our white and red, and you get pink. What about, ooh, there are some colors we haven't mentioned yet. We have our white, and what about black? And when we mix, 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 mix them together, we get gray. So that's how you get gray. And there's some other color mixings that you can do. So maybe if you want, you can check out our color kittens and find out how to make some other colors. Make sure you have a grown up with you before you experiment with those pink colors though, okay? Awesome. Now, it is time for us to say goodnight to all of our kitty cat friends after such a long story. And with the rain falling outside, they're sleepy. And me too. So let's see what bedtime stories we have for them. Now, all of these books are books that you can check out at the Henry County Library. So you can go to any one of us and we will have these books for you. So we have Clifford's Kitten. So here's Clifford the Big Red Dog. This is a story about what happens when he finds a lost kitten. And then we have Otis and the Kittens. Otis is a tractor and he finds a kitten outside. And then he sees a barn on fire. Oh no! So it's about how he helps save the day and the kittens. And then we have the three little kittens and they're wearing mittens. This story is mostly illustrated, so it's a fun story to make up the words as you go along about our kittens and how they lose those mittens. I wonder if they'll find. This one's a fun one to read. It's everybody says meow, because that's what all of our kitty cat friends say, remember? There's another animal that comes along and he tries to talk to them but kitty cats only say meow, so you have to check it out and find out how the story ends. And if we have some beginning readers out there that are learning to read, this is an excellent story. It is called Flubby. Flubby is not a good pet. Oh no, I wonder why someone would say that about poor Flubby. You've got to check it out and read it and find out. And for our last kitty cat story, we have Kitten's First Full Moon. Now Kitten here has never seen a full moon before in the sky. And Kitten thinks it looks like something delicious, something more familiar. 
have to check it out and read it. It's such a great story, just like all of our other ones. So if you saw a story that you really want to read, come by the library and check it out and read some of our kitty cat stories. I hope you enjoyed today's story time, boys and girls. I know I did, and so did all of our kitty cat friends. We'll see you again next time for another story. Hope to see you then. Bye.